I'm here at Our Lady's Catholic School in Prescott to see the fantastic work the LFC Foundation do in the community to inspire young people. And I've even bought first team players Fabio and Riley. Let's see what's going on. That love for sport, enjoyment for sport, it doesn't, doesn't have to be football. Obviously if it is brilliant, we get them tasting sessions like they're doing today in basketball and other sports. And then the idea is to try and signpost them into local sports clubs, take them find their passion most of us are not going to be fortunate enough to be professional athletes, but if we can find a passion in a sport that we enjoy for life, then that's uh, that's job done. I think we haven't been playing our best, but uh, I'm sure things, through things like this, uh, we can get back to the community and, and really help the new generation. It's really amazing to me. I think just to be able to do something that I never really had growing up uh, is what means the most to me. And to be able to just influence them in whatever way is possible. Um, not everyone's a footballer, not everyone's an athlete, but just to show them that there are different directions and give them a little bit of advice. I like how I can just come in and influence them and just talk about different things and how they can get involved and excite them a little bit. Do you have like a balanced diet that you have to like follow? You want to get your protein in. I also have a balanced diet with carbs in it and carbs can be my breads and everything like that, but it could also be the fruit. So having to make sure I get all those things into my diet every day is really important. For them to get to see players not just on the pitch but see them as human beings and ask them those sort of questions is huge. Why did you want to be a goalkeeper? I loved um, the adrenaline rush. The best position for me, um, the place where I felt the most comfortable where I could express myself and who I am as a person was in goal. I got to be fearless, I got to be brave. All children have got dreams and they really want to be something, you know, do something with their lives as well. Coming out of you know, two years of the pandemic, that mental health has really been affected badly for children in schools. And now they've got a chance now to see, be inspired by someone, coming in, working with them, showing what they can do, what they can be. Why inspired you to play football? Uh, it's just everything I've done my whole life since I was like probably your age. Here you go, here you go. <laughs> nah, oh, these are good. I just hope that they have fun. That's the most important thing and that they cherish this moment. I don't feel pressure. <laughs> Not bad. Unlucky, unlucky. Yeah, next one, next one. Ah! Sportsmanship is the, is the main thing. Basketball is the winner. <laughs> yeah, I just hope that they have fun and they learn something and they come to school um, each day enjoying to, to take part in football, basketball, just different activities that keep them active, which is good for, for physically and mentally as well. Liverpool!